A Rockland woman is going the extra mile to raise money to keep a portion of the Vietnam veterans moving wall in White Pine. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Sarah Blakely has the details on this woman's journey up close. 2,118 miles. That's how far Rockland, Michigan is from San Jose, California. And it's how many miles Jenny Kennyinen is running on her treadmill. But what would possess someone to run over 2,000 miles? Kennyinen says she's running to raise money to help construct a building to permanently house a piece of the Vietnam Veterans Moving Wall Memorial in White Pine. I figured if I could get pledges per mile or maybe just straight up donations from people, that would support me to raise money for the wall. Previously in San Jose, the creator of the moving wall, who is Kenny Einan's brother-in-law, moved to White Pine with his family a few years ago and took the memorabilia with him to set up a museum here. The founder's wife, Joy Devitt, says they wanted to set it up where regional veterans could access it. I figure any, any other monuments or things that are across the United States that people go and visit, they will come and they will enjoy seeing it when we can make it a reality. Kenny Einan says since last July, only a couple thousand dollars have been raised, and she isn't sure exactly how much it's going to cost. But since the beginning of March, she runs about seven miles a day, which takes her just under an hour and a half each morning before work. And she's already made it as far as Duluth. And I have 239 miles to run from Duluth, Minnesota to Fargo, North Dakota. That's my next, you know, leg of the journey. It'll take her about 200 days to finish the run. She says they hope to have funds raised in the project in process in about three years. We want to um, put the museum together to um, let people come and learn about the history of it and see some of the artifacts. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Rockland.